So I had a few people ask me what I had done to do the spreading error texture in my latest video, Weaponized Negativity, so I figured I'd uh, do a quick video to show what actually I did. It's pretty easy, it's just tedious. First thing I did was just render out the basic animation with no texture changed at all. That would be this one up here. Then I rendered it out with the error texture, so if I would turn off this one, it would have the error texture filled already. Then I used the mask tool in Sony Vegas. I think most uh, video editing software should have some sort of mask tool. And I had it slowly wipe away the original one to reveal the error underneath. So you can see over here where the mask is, it reveals the error. <clears throat> so essentially, it's just I, I rendered out two of the exact same shot, just with uh, different textures. And then in Sony Vegas, I had one shot be slowly wiped away. Uh, over here, I did something a little bit extra. I used a kind of like a green screen kind of thing because if I hadn't used the green screen, let's see, I move this over here. Uh, since I deleted the texture for the engineer, he would have the one holding it would have looked pretty nasty too. So. I put on the green screen to restrict it to only the other engineer. That's pretty much it. It just you need to render out the same scene twice, just with the uh, different texture you want, and then have it wipe away. So if you see here, I have it slowly wiping this way. So if I were to go into here and move this, you can see it changes where the error is. So it's just a pretty easy wipe from left to right. I could make it uh, go the opposite direction too. Um, you should be able to do this in most video editing software. They should all have wiping. Even in like Windows Movie Maker that should work. It'll just be a bit tougher and won't look quite as nice. But just a, a wipe from side to side revealing the scene under it would do it. And that's it. Um, it's a pretty simple technique. Just the replacement of the texture is a bit of an obnoxious. Let me show you how to do that. So Valve is nice enough to include all of the textures in an easy-to-reach location in Source Filmmaker, which is nice of them. So I went to Materials, and then Models, and then Player, and you have all the characters here. So now the default error texture for when there is no texture for Source is that purple and black checkerboard. So actually what all I did was I just deleted the Engineer and Heavy, and then they showed up with that error texture in the Source Filmmaker. So you can do that. Uh, pretty easily. And then for the green one, all I did was I went in and I edited every single one of their textures. Uh, it's like uh, here. I would export it, I would I colored it all in green, and then I imported it back in again as all green and saved it. So yeah, it's pretty easy to do. Just takes a while to go through all the textures. That's pretty much all there is it uh, is to it. Just some uh, tricky masking, that's all.